Okay, here we are again, driving in Finland and Sweden, or Sweden and Finland. Jim Pettibone here, by the way. Uh, this, this has been a tough one to research. Uh, and, yeah, let me know. Somebody out there is bound to know. Um, it uh, says that I'm taking a load of crumple cram from Nyasham, Sweden, to Alajarvi, Finland. I have 30 hours and 3 minutes on the contract. 9,818 euros completing the job. Uh, we'll be driving a Mercedes New Actros Gigaspace, 510 horsepower, 2,500 newton meters of torque, uh, power shift G 281-12R, 12 speed with retarder, I imagine. Oops, gotta do that. Uh oh. No, nope, gotta do this. Gotta do that. There. Oh, this looks strangely the same. Anyway, <sighs> go back here. Crumple cram. Not a clue. The only the only thing I found was on some knitting site. Uh, it was a German translation. And uh, translation wise, it comes up to be crumple stuff. Well, I don't know what crumple is. But, uh, like I said, the only thing that showed up was on like a. Uh, oh, the woman was talking about using her spinning wheel. So I'm guessing I'm prob I could be completely wrong, but I'm guessing it was some kind of uh, uh, raw wool or uh, alpaca or something to that effect. I'm not sure what it is. It, the, the translation translator didn't didn't translate anything out. But like I said, it did come across the one site that that it had. She was talking about. Uh, strands of crump, crumple stuff. So I don't... This is the one... This is one load I have no real idea what I'm delivering. But we got a truckload of it. Well, there it is. And, you know, looking at the side... That doesn't give you a clue, because that looks like that's all auto parts. So, again, let's take our picture. There it is. And let's get the cab. Let's um, do the brake and start our truck up it's uh, nine o'clock in the morning I got almost 18 hours but again I think we're taking the ferry so it's 11 hours cut off so it's about a six what 18 six hour drive somewhere in that neighborhood uh, well we'll just turn on our running lights right now put in gear Take off the parking brake. And we'll just head on over here. And. Well, okay, we'll wait for this truck. And we'll wait for this truck. Oh, 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 oh. We got way over there to get out. Uh. Now, 
and I think we're going to Stockholm again. Catch the ferry. Oops. Obviously, we're not carrying a lot of weight because we're accelerating for oh, 20 tons. <coughs> Excuse me. We're not carrying a lot of weight because we're accelerating up this hill. heading off towards the ferries. A slightly different trip this way, or this time. Yes, and I know I'm not driving quite legally. I 
I should have turned into my... Oh, what in the world? So far in all my trips down here, I haven't come across running into anything coming out. Everything down here is always, usually always parked. We're going to Turku. Turku. Oh, where are you at? All right. There we are. There we are. There we are. There we are. Eleven hours. Crumble crumb. And it's nine o'clock at night. We'll turn on our headlights. Yeah, eighty. Yeah, sure. Right. speed bumps, they do smooth out at higher speed. Okay, 394 kilometers, six, not quite six and a half hours driving. sun. Pretty 
much most of the way. All right, let's set our cruise control. Now I can concentrate on driving and not trying to pay attention to how fast I'm going. a little easier. I don't have to spend the time looking down at the... Yeah, well... In theory, it's supposed to work that way. In reality, well, sometimes you get a little uh, distracted. So, again, if you like what you're seeing, thumbs up. Really like what you're seeing, subscribe. That way you can follow me across Europe. Still got a long ways to go. There's... Six, like eight countries I haven't even been into yet. And occasionally I take these little side hops like I did the last video. seem interesting so go do it and since I still have the short haul uh, I mean there's jobs that I'm missing out on because they're be long drives, but again, with the long drives, then you start to suffer from maybe not finding, a, or not, not ever getting the chance to go to uh, some of the cities. Because they're just, you wind up a short distance or whatever, or you have to wind up. So far, I haven't had to know, do any of these drives where I've had to stop and rest. I don't think. Close on one. I was actually got a couple of tickets. I think I got a couple of tickets for overrunning. And that was the the Ural truck. So far, I haven't had to. Oh, this again. So far, I haven't had to take a rest yet. Long distance is one of the last things I want to put. Uh, anything into uh, I think I still have a couple of spots of um, an urgent delivery um, I 
think I still have a couple spots of urgent delivery. Whoa! <sighs> Didn't see that sign. Again, what we're doing now, driving up this way, is we're building our our uh, base for heading up to uh, Murmansk and the Norwegian cities beyond. Yeah, a little after midnight. And here we are. <coughs> Headlights are not all really that much improvement. But I did find by making that run in, in Germany, that last run in Germany, that because we're in the higher uh, latitudes, no, lower latitudes, yeah, lower latitudes. Because we're so far north that the basically the sun hardly sets. Because for the last few last few videos, last few runs, it's been like this the whole trip, day or night. But when I was down making that run in Germany, it was you know, what you saw in front of you was what basically while well, your headlights lit up. small village up here somewhere where I have to slow down.
like a T intersection, a few houses, and I think it goes to 50, and then once you get outside the houses, you're back up to 80 again. I don't know what that is. <laughs> Thought it was a cow. Nope, don't sound like a cow. Sounds like something else. Something may want to eat the truck. can I talk about for an hour and 15 minutes driving time okay let's see thumbs up done that really like what you're seeing subscribe did that comments anybody watching this if they know what crumple crumple what was it? Crumple crumb. Crumple stuff. If they really know what it is, you know, leave me a little message. I, 
try to look these things up when I really, I'm not sure what they are. Uh, don't like to seem to appear to be just a complete, total idiot. <clears throat> and if I don't know what they are, I'm sure that there's probably a large amount of people that they don't know what it is. So just because it's a blah, 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 that's there, so I'll put that in the initial description, but then when I get into the actual description, if I can find out or figure it out, description if it's in German with the initial thing or the initial description usually if I can translate it I'll put it in English in the bottom or in the the full description or the not full fuller description of the run I try to put these city names into the translator and then I play I can play a uh, or the computer will do a sound bite on it or pronounce it but a lot of times I forget or I do it after the video oh I think we're going to turn right here somewhere shortly Okay, if I'm thinking, yep, there it is. Now, can I... If I go down here... No, I can't get through there. I don't put on the four-way flashers while we're doing this. I'm fairly certain I can just drive around here. Back up through the sawdust pile. And then right up into this parking stall spot. That didn't sound good. What did we do? Oh, nothing really. We just got pulled forward just a little bit. Turn our wheels back. And there it is. And that's all there is to it. And we're going to do that. So, there we are. Put on our brake. Turn off our four way flushers and take it out of gear. That was the other thing. And disconnect our trailer. And there we are. Job completed. Excellent. Crumple cram. Crumb. Delivered from Ninishim to. Uh, Ala, Ala RV, Ala, 
Gutland. Ali Arvi. Sweden. Or er, Switzerland. Or er, Finland. Uh, 440 kilometers, 17 hours and 55 minutes, 11 hours, that was a ferry ride. 217.8 liters of fuel, an urgent delivery, made 9,818 euros and 573 experience points. And that, I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, again, like it. Subscribe. Comment. Tell me what crumple crumb crumple crumb is. Anyway, hope you enjoyed it, and thank you for watching. And that's the end of this video.